It's Around Town with Mandy, and I'd like to welcome a new community to Queen Anne's County. Queenstown Landing, assisted living and memory care, right by the emergency room. Let's go in and get a tour. So I'm here with Rebecca, the community relations director. Right, fancy for sales and marketing. Yeah. Well, welcome, welcome to Queen Anne's County. Thank you, we're very happy to be here. Tell us a little bit about why Queenstown Landing picked this location and decided to come to Queen Anne's County. Great question. So we recognized very quickly that there was a need for more assisted living and memory care options in Queen Anne's County for the residents of the Eastern Shore. There is not, there are a couple of options, but there are more with the population. As our population in general starts to age, uh, our communities are needed to help serve the area that they're in. Yes. And what a great location, because you're kind of in the middle of everything. Right. Tell us a little bit about your little wording you guys have here. Well, this is our residents' home. It's going to be home to 51 residents uh, shortly. And so we want to foster that culture. We want, this is their home, we want them to be at home. and. So we're not a facility, we are their community. Yes. So we have our overall community and within the community we have our assisted living neighborhood that we're sitting in right now and we have our memory care neighborhood right down the hall. On the assisted living facade, how many bedrooms are on that side? We have 32 apartments in the assisted living neighborhood. Uh, it's a mix of studios and one bedrooms. Okay. So a studio, if you think of a hotel and hotel rooms, a studio is like, your bedroom with uh, your private bathroom, and it also does have a little kitchenette. And then our one bedroom apartments are like a suite. You have uh, a kitchenette that's a little bit bigger, a nice separate living room, and then you have the separate bedroom and the private bathroom. Tell us a little about the showers here. Yeah, so all the showers are huge. You slide right in. They have a built-in bench and two shower heads. You have your regular shower head and then you have a handheld adjustable shower head as well and lots of grab bars. So it fits all needs. Mm -hmm, absolutely. You guys are pet friendly. We are pet friendly for uh, cats and dogs, yeah. 25 pounds and under, yes. Nice. Everybody used to see watches. You guys. Correct. So this is the help here? button guys... and also their key to their apartment. And nice. then again, if we have a wanderer, we can activate that feature and just keep track of them, keep them safe. And one thing we didn't mention, they're waterproof. Exactly, they are. They don't ever need to come off. They can just so stay can on shower. all the time. Absolutely. What they'll use it every day for, it's their room key into their apartment. Wow. Yeah, they just, they don't even have to touch it to the door. They get close to the door. It It'll activates unlock. and unlocks their apartment only. Rebecca, tell us a little bit about the area we're in now. So right now we're standing in our living room. We have our gorgeous fireplace over here. Great place to sit and relax and warm up. We have the library over here where our residents can borrow any of the books that they'd like, take a, take a little read and return them when they're done. And then on the other side of the fireplace, we have our bistro area where there's another sitting area. They can enjoy the fireplace. They can get a snack or a drink. Great, open, warm, and welcoming place. Yes. There's an activity room. Yes. Um, it's got some pretty cool chairs in it. I was a little jealous. Super comfy chairs. I think we can just stay here for the rest of the afternoon. Uh, maybe we can get Chef to come in and cook us a snack in the kitchen over here. Maybe we can crank up the popcorn machine. I'm for it. Put on the <laughs> movies. <laughs> yeah. Because it looks pretty cool. Yeah. Um, there's a little kitchenette in there. Yeah. And you there's can have a full kitchen and, in there. Yeah. So they can do, uh, so chef can do cooking demonstrations in there or they can, our activities director can do different activities, baking and cooking. Um, they will definitely watch movies or sporting events, major events, things like that. And then also just arts and crafts and different yeah. projects. Mm -hmm. Something new, you have a local artist wall. We do. Our developer really wanted to encourage uh, our local art community. So we we're having a, we had an art contest actually for part of our grand opening, and we have uh, maybe 15 pieces of art from uh -huh. local artists that they have submitted. And then as we make our way down the community, um, we have a beauty parlor. So who doesn't love a new hairdo? This is our hair salon, Hair Heaven. So we have two chairs in here, in here, and we will also have someone coming in to do Manny Petty.
And then we have the spa room with a really nice spa tub for some of our residents who just don't like a shower. Uh -huh. So we can treat them to a really nice bath. So we've made our way through the door and Rebecca, here we're into the memory care community. Yes, so this is the memory care neighborhood. We're in the living room right now. We have the dining room right next door. And then on the other side, we have the activities area and we can hear our little bird friends chirping away in there at the bird aviary. That's pretty cool. So you were telling me about the aviary. Um, you guys saw that in another place you had looked at, and that's one of the things they picked up, one that yeah, um, they all, enjoy. Yes, all of our communities in our yeah. company have the bird, have the aviaries, and the, the seniors, particularly the memory care residents, really enjoy sitting next to the aviary and just watching the birds do their thing. Well, some are probably wondering why a little makeshift nursery. But you were telling us this is big in, in uh, communities like this Yes, yeah. for the seniors. This is the nurture station that we were talking about. So this will be a very comforting area for some of our residents to be able to maybe rock a baby or swaddle the baby or just carry a baby and walk around a little bit. This will be a very, very comforting area what's gonna work best for them and what will help them thrive. That's what this is all about. It's helping our residents thrive. Yes. And then we make our way, one thing we didn't talk about in assistant living is the dining room. Right. Founders Landing. Yes, mm -hmm. and it's great. And um, you talked about how something will always be on the menu right. and available, but they could order things as well. Yes, so when they come in for the meals, when our residents come in for their meals, they'll be, they'll be greeted uh, by a server very similar to restaurant style. Chef really wants to run the dining room in a restaurant fashion. So they'll, they'll have a menu and they'll be able to order and then the food will be prepared fresh. It's not gonna be sitting back there just to be plated up. So of course that takes a little bit of time. So if they, if they just don't wanna wait, we will have something that is ready now, hot and ready now that will be plated up if they'd rather have that and served to them immediately. Nice. So I think the last part we missed was the outdoors. Yeah. So Rebecca, we talked about both areas have a sitting area, but this one we noticed it's a little more secure. Yeah, so this is the courtyard in the memory care neighborhood and it is completely secure so that our residents can come out and enjoy being outside in the fresh air, but they're safe. So we, we plan on having uh, our residents have ample opportunity yeah, for fresh air time. and be yeah. outside, yes. I mm -hmm. see some bird houses out there. Yeah, and there will yeah. be more, definitely will be more all around the community. Uh, so no matter what room you're in, hopefully out your window, you'll be able to see some birds. So as we end our tour, we've decided to end it outdoors. And why not at the assistant living courtyard? So thanks for having us. What an amazing location and a place for seniors to come into Queen Anne's County and to become a new home. Um, again, tell people if they want to get a hold of you, how can they get a hold of you guys here? Please give us a call at 410-304-2005. We can't wait to meet you. Thanks for watching Around Town with Mandy. We'll see you next time.